He is the influential head of the radical northern wing of the Islamic movement in Israel and a vehement critic of Israeli policy. But today, instead of preparing for a speaking engagement at the British Parliament, Sheikh Rayad Salah is sitting in a police cell awaiting deportation from Britain. His supporters are furious. It was a complete shock given the fact that he has um, said all of these allegations are completely uh, without any basis and moreover he condemns all forms of racism including anti-Semitism, Islamophobia and racism against his own people, the Palestinians. Uh, I was truly horrified to find that this had happened late last night. The British Interior Ministry, the Home Office, has been severely embarrassed by the arrival of Sheikh Saleh in the UK, given that under the apparent travel ban, theoretically, border authorities should have stopped him as soon as his plane landed. But Sheikh Saleh's supporters are also asking officials here when and why that travel ban was imposed, when even Israel recognises Sheikh Saleh's organisation as legitimate. The criteria for exclusion is broad and can include anyone whose presence is judged not conducive to the public good. There's been only a brief explanatory statement from the Interior Minister saying, we do not normally comment on individual cases, but in this case I think it is important to do so. I can confirm he was excluded and that he managed to enter the UK. He has now been detained and the UK border agency is now making arrangements to remove him. Salah has had multiple run-ins with the Israeli authorities in the past. He spent two years behind bars in 2003, accused of raising millions of pounds for Hamas. But the motives for the British authorities detaining him now are far from clear. Paul Brennan, Al Jazeera, London. Well, Salah has frequently provoked the Israeli authorities over the years. He's part of the Islamic movement in Israel, an organization that isn't banned, but's closely monitored by Israeli officials. He was barred from travelling to the UK, though the UK Home Office has not confirmed when or why the travel ban was put in place. Salah has been detained several times in Israel, most recently at the Jordan-Israeli border after he'd allegedly hit an interrogator. And in 2010, he spent five months in jail for spitting at an Israeli police officer. He was also held after taking part in a Gaza-bound aid flotilla that Israeli naval commandos stormed in May of last year.